um, the um, it, it's just so horrible. Um, it's really it, I, I've been in such a shock since March 11. I, I've been just stunned, terrified, because I knew what was happening to North America, and I'm really sorry to tell you this today, but I, I think people should know. I mean, I wanted to know, as horrible as it is, but at least people can take iodine. Here is some seaweed that one of the visitors today brought so that you could see it. You can go to health food stores and buy kelp powder. You just put like a half a teaspoon in water every day and drink it. You can get tincture of iodine for $2.50 at a drugstore and you just rub it on your skin here over your thyroid. Your thyroid is between your Adam's apple and your collarbone and it wraps around the esophagus. This is the most important thing to protect. And you have to do it for the next year. This stuff is going to continue to be coming across the ocean until they really stop it and cover it and entomb it. The uh, half-life of iodine 131 is eight and a half days. It takes 10 and a half lives for the radiation to diminish. So that's 85 days before it's diminished. And you want to flood your thyroid and your body with iodine so that it prevents uptake of the radioactive iodine. When you damage the thyroid, that is causing obesity, uh, immune system damage, uh, all kinds of problems in the body. The thyroid signals the mother's brain to control develop, development of the brain in the developing baby. So it's pregnant women and babies and children and the elderly who are the most damaged because people in their early and middle years are pretty healthy, they have functioning immune systems and they're more able to survive the damage from the free radicals that are released by the, uh, the radiation particles. So please go everyone today and be sure you take iodine every day for at least the next six months or year. It may save your life. And remember the epidemic of thyroid cancer during and after bomb testing? We don't need to have that happen to us. We can prevent it if we just do simple things. You can also put the iodine on the skin of your abdomen or anywhere out of sight. It washes off in the shower and it goes right through your skin. So please just do that every day. It's so cheap to do.